What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Ziggy. We back here with music, mayhem, and hey, we just got six songs here to react to for today, and you already know. I'm all about giving back to the community, to the Jericho community, because I gotta say, most of the times when you always think like, the Nerco community is always consists of like the major ones like the DPS, the Fable, the Schwab, Schwabity, Conquest, and so and such. And don't get me wrong, that is true. But come on now, we can't just like forget the other people who hasn't been in the Nerco community, who has been in the Nerco community for years and such. And like I said before, with the ciphers that's been happening throughout the past number of years and no matter which songs and such, you gotta remember, if it wasn't so, so certain artists like these that I'm about to react to, some of your favorite nerdcore songs wouldn't be playlist material if it wasn't for them. Hey, I'm just saying. But either way, we're gonna start this first one off with Surveyed. Shout out to Rumble World with Underworld official live video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials out there. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Comment how many reference. This is basically off of his album Mortal Kombat. So, so far I got Link Kuei, which is from well, Link Kuei, Punch. Bro, it's going to be hard for me because nine times out of ten, there are certain Mortal Kombat because I've watched like certain gameplay, like the movie wise on certain Mortal Kombat things. So. It's kind of going to be hard for me to remember. Body and that off white on sight looking like Quan Chi. Damn, it's different when in the ring with me. Code is in my camp, the link quick can never compete with me or beef with me. I'm easily eating weaker MCs for free. And niggas got the nerve to put themselves up at the peak with B. AKA Savay say the name I aim is spray. He thought he sent me to the crypt, he made a grave mistake. Bitch, I could blitz up on the track with the best of a mic get his ass on the beat and fucking Hannibal Lecter. I'm up. I could blitz up on the track with the best if a mic get his ass on the beat and fucking Hannibal Lecter I'm up Dang so I'm with it, a soul snatcher, I'll potty him Hard to the pole till I'm ripping all of them out of ya Nether round bound, my demons ready surrounding ya You ain't moving shit, you like ninja mime so we clowning ya please You only serve as a revenant, just a part in my game who's lacking intelligence I lavish a metal and claiming they black on the track, in fact they lacking in melanin Got that dog in them a pit but you actually fell in it going crap Hold up now And the thing is I've said this before with certain nerdcore artists you gotta remember sir Like this is why I mostly do this is why I always want to do music mayhem because it's people it's artists like surveyed and such It's like hella underrated Straight up lacking intelligence, I lavish a metal and claiming they black on the track, in fact they lacking the melon. Claiming they black on the track, in fact they lacking the melanin. Mm. Hey. Some of y'all rappers out there, some of y'all some of your favorite rappers out there acting like they hard and such, acting like they all this, but you hear what you say, hard to the bone until you work till I start ripping off. Mm. Gonna track, in fact, they lacking in melanin. Got that dog in them a pit, but you actually fell in it. Going crowd surf with the dead. I learned the pit. All right. So if you don't know the pit, the pit is more of like one of those Mortal Kombat fatalities where if you where if you do the right moves and such, you knock them. You like knock them so high they go into the pit, and let's just face it. You go, your body starts splitting out of control. It depends on what stage you're on in the. Well, it has its own specific 
area, so. Then got that dog in my pit. Boy, you actually yeah. fell in yeah, it. Going crowd surf with the dead. I learned from the best. That's Kung Lao. How a big round circle your head. Want the fade, you get the tremor in the earth where you rest. I lift up. Ooh, nice wordplay right there. Want the fade, you get tremor in the earth where you rest. Tremor. You think you are. I'm catching them. Trim or tremor. If you don't know, this a Mortal Kombat player who is literally rock. You can literally say he's like an earthbender in a way. He's like the earthbender in Mortal Kombat where his power is. Power is mostly making of stone. In the earth where you rest, I lift the arm and let it rain. Now he the first to get wet. The cake's back. If you're sitting on my throne, get replaced. He Shao Kahn now. All you see is bones in his face. Bones in his face. Shao Kahn. Most, mostly like, like that warrior and such. Shao Kahn now. All you see is bones in his face. I beat him to the brink of death to make him forfeit his plan. Did he get fully wiped out like all of Scorpion's clan? Damn. Now, with that one, if y'all know the whole entire thing about Mortal Kombat, like the most main one and such, even if it's not Mortal Kombat, it's the old typical Scorpio versus Sub Zero. And the reason, the reason for that is because Sub Zero, his clan and such wiped out Scorpio's clan, which included Scorpio's family, including his wife and son, if I'm not mistaken, so, hey, that one kind of gonna cut they deep. Can this plan, did he get fully wiped out like all of Scorpion's uh, clan? Scorpion's Damn, clan. now you can try to escape your fate if you wanna, I ain't Jay, but you would think otherwise, when you see Katana's keeping time, you're busy mm. claiming she missed me, I make her hit the splits, she fucked the meetup so bad, I'm hollering, finish her, Civic. But you would think otherwise when you see Katana's keeping time. I ain't Jade until Busy claiming she missed me. I make her hit the splits. She fucked the meat up so bad I'm hollering, finish her. Civvy got the spotlight. Safe to say that they notice and I'm fire off top like when Sonya play when I blow a kiss. Hey no boy, I'm falling on everybody when rolling in. Reptile, why you mad at me? This is how I'm supposed to spit. Reptile, so Kano, this He's like this big Russian guy and such, rugged and such, but he's freaking smart when it comes to the weaponry. Hold on, let me see if I can be able to see if he got the spotlight. Safe to say they notice it. So, to say that they notice it. Fire. Firing off top, like, firing off top, like when Sonya Blade wanna blow a kiss. So, Sonya Blade. Dark. Well, uh, no. She's freaking. She's not like a more combat person, but she's like, like a. You can say like in a way like an agent or so, but she badass. Like Fire off top like when Sonya play when I blow a kiss. Kano boy, I'm falling on everybody when rolling in. Reptile, why you mad at me? This how I'm supposed to spit. And I stay working for all the views that I got. Mike Umar Johnson the fit. That's noob side by Rumble word is the best with the pupils like new eye drops. Got your name in the ring. Basically, he's like a wrestler. Look, y'all. I think I don't watch some of the. I think I don't get my Mortal Kombat. But that's like I told y'all before. Like I said at the start, I've seen some of the, like we can say, movie gameplay and such. Trust me. I be peeping. I'm the way that the arm wave. And if we boss get his moves red like the arcade, they won't catch every bar made by the time that we part ways. We can do this the midway, or we can do this the hard way, nigga. I'll try to dance with the devil, boy. The same what you want. Hey, shout out to Surveyed, man. You're always doing your thing, bro. And hope, and hold on. Before we get into the next song, you said after this song you had to go. I get, hope you feel better, basically, because you said you had surgery, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. But when you see this, bro. Hope you said after this you're gonna recover and such. Hey, hope you get feel well, brother. But fire song by you.
Next we got Rap Knight featuring Rad Remington, Attack on Titans, Aaron Yeager Rap, or Aaron Yeager Song, Pushed Me, Pushed to the Edge. The song is holistically made from direct inspiration from the show Attack on Titans. Every line or bar is talking about things that happen or directly linked to the show, not a comparison to real life in any shape or form. This, this is how all my own personal songs will be from now on. Alright. That's for me to decide. You may say that, but that's for me to decide right now. They took our mothers, brothers, sisters. But somewhere in my head, I guess I still thought we could talk it out. Probably saw hope in the thoughts and the opinions of the people that I love. So I subscribed to what they was on about. But looking back was where the silliest thoughts of people who didn't know how much their blacks the freedom would cost. With seas and with stars, and they've taken everything that we've got. So the freedoms and their freedoms, the only freedom I want. Pardon, this world does not forgive And I say forgive like any one of us There's something wrong Like we were seen as less than dumb all from the day we're born Like they didn't almost wipe us out I guess it's not enough I guess they have to take my bloody mom and everything I love But to be honest And hey And it's like this with Aaron Yeager, right? At the sense you kind of get what he's saying about how Some of like the Titans always Like the Titans like ruin everything and such was making everybody's life either like paranoid, miserable, tripping, and whatnot and such. But the thing is, what made Aaron Yeager go went from being the good protagonist to the villain you can say now is the fact that he thinks that all of it is bad because it happened to him. Like my dude. You don't think that don't happen to him? Like, this is how I'm looking at it, right? He acts like because it happened to only him and him alone, that it, it basically, like, just because it happened to him, he should he feel that like since, he's, since he's feeling all the pain and such, everybody should feel how his pain is. When nigga, in reality, everybody's feeling the pain too, so... That's how that's how I see it as like simple terms. I know people are gonna go into the whole whole like real deep backstory and such, but honestly, I feel like that's how it is. And hey, I'll listen to what the deep meaning of all of these methods are and such, but at the end of the day I feel like Ju because it he thinks just because it happened to him that he gonna want everybody to feel pain. Truth be told, my dude, you don't think everybody else is affected by it? So, that's all I'm saying. I think I'm way past the anger now. Actually, I see what you loved it to us is rational. If you have enemies, wipe them out is what you do. So this time it'll be us who's gonna spend genocide by the And I 
because I see that you drop other music from them and such. I shouldn't want to react to that. I'm not going to lie to you. I do want to react to the ones that you dropped, dropped, dropped prior to this and such. Maybe I should. Y'all let me know if I should. But this, is a, this was a question of the Protect my people by simply ending everything Or David with the world against an overwhelming enemy And save it Go from devils to the heroes Now I'm Shout out to Rap Night, man. That one was like powerful in the terms of like how Aaron Yeager's whole thing was from hating the Titan to becoming one and then feeling like the world is against him in a way. But hey, either way, shout out to Rap Night, shout out to Rad, Rad Remington. You freaking, that chorus was freaking powerful as hell. Not gonna lie to you, but make sure y'all go subscribe to Rap Night. He doing his thing. But now to Tootsie bro. Where have you been, my nigga? Hmm? You've been gone for a long time, huh? But well, then again, so high. I mean, so high from your channel. I ain't gonna lie to you. I can't blame you. I've gone from your channel for a long time, so I can't blame you. But welcome back, my boy. But now we got against all odds. Against the odds. Is it a metal song? That's what any type of music is all about, no matter if it's rock, rap, hip-hop, well, rock and, well, rap and hip-hop is kind of the same thing, but it depends on which one it is, but either way, it depends on what, no matter which music you are, you always got to have the rhythm, so certain times you feel like, I feel like you're a little offbeat here and there, so, but either way, you speak, your lyrics is saying something, it's just that the way, the rhythm of it, Kind of, it kind of always goes off beat for me. But right here, you. I never thought you would go into this rock, rock.
talk rap type vibe. That's why I feel like you need to watch him more of a little fable and such. I feel like he's your like your inspiration. I don't know why. I just have a sense. I like such I could believe I could be wrong but for your first time or two that you wanted to do some rock music for a long time you can answer it's either that or that it's either if you were inspired by Fable to do it for the first time or you've been wanting to do it for a long time but hey either way shout out to you to see your graduate back now man hopefully we get more music from you my dude but either way now, now the race is about to begin with a song, Sonic, Sonic Riders song, I don't know what the heck is, I'm not even, it's content, we'll kick off in a short time. saying Roxu, Roxu's back y'all let me know what that is that like an alternate ego of yours or so cuz cuz I saw it the start where it says artist Roxu Roxu and such y'all let me know is that like an alter ego of yours or that's a artist you can bring up or something like, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna.
know, like, is that like a alter ego for you in search? Because I feel like that is. Like, let me know when you see this video if, like, that's an alter ego you can say of yours. But either way, that was fire. Like, it got that, like, I wouldn't say, like, EDM vibes. It kind of is. But it's like a different mixture of that. Like, I don't know what to call it. You can let, y'all let me know what you can call that. Because either way, it was fire. Not gonna lie. Oh, Tapu Underworld, you already know. Black Diamonds, Inuyasha Rap, Forged by Fire. And trust me, look y'all, certain songs from Black, now, trust me, Black Diamonds, these are artists I come back for real, real when it comes to his music. Just on first reaction alone, whenever he drops his music, I'm on it like that. But the thing is, him, Delta D's too and such, I be, you don't know how many times on Spotify when I see that they drop some new music and such, I be waiting to see how it's, I be waiting on when they drop it on their channels and such, cause trust me, Black Diamonds, I've said it before and I'll say it again, him, Delta, and you can say, well, let me say, them two are like most, some of the most, two of the most sauciest niggas in not just Otaku Underworld, but in Nerdcore. I'm just saying. But either way, Pipe up watch my fire. Let's get it. Baby, I don't crib key, run free. Don't you come back just for me. You diss me, miss me. This ain't coming cheap to me. I lost cause just be. Cause I let you back and girl, that don't mean safety. Better get to packing cause I be with the hardest where the darkness be. I can't think of shit to get you off of me. I'm supposed to share you when you offer me You offer me, yeah, you offer me How can I love someone else when it's always been you? They said you wanted my head at first, I was confused, didn't know what to do Do if that arrow would touch me, that man it was over and this is the end Soon as I woke yeah. up my body, I would never get slighted by loving again Can't lie, that shit hurts still, cause I put you first Yeah, that girl a priest is to this day, I ain't been in no church No offense yeah. to Jesus, but all these blessings, I feel like we cursed I like this, bro. The, the court. Yo, what can I say? Black Diamonds has that sauce family, bro. That most nerdcore artists needs to have, man. Or well, not just even nerdcore artists. Let me not say that. Most artists in general, most people who do music needs to have, cause. And when that's and when it comes to the sauce. You don't have to forcefully put it in. It just gotta come on natural, right? Cause a lot of times when it comes to music, people think like, oh, I need to, I need to put on a sauce level on something and such. Nah. Sometimes if you, if it comes on natural, it will come on natural on a song and with the lyrics too. Bro, play this already. Cause I've been holding on for a hot as minute, y'all don't understand. Whenever I see that they drop music on their Spotify, I hold on to it for a hot ass minute until when I see they put it on their YouTube channel. That's how I do it. The minute you put it on your YouTube channel, I want to react to it, and if it's that fire, I add it onto my playlist. And right now, play this. Yeah, I don't crib, keep run free. Don't you come back just for me. You diss me, miss me. This ain't coming cheap to me. I lost cause just be. Cause I let you back and girl, that don't mean safety. Better get to packing cause I be with the hardest where the darkness be. I can't think of shit to get you off of me. I'm supposed to share you when you offer me. Try to make love you. I see you out now, I dub you. Couldn't have you, so you rather shoot me. This love story comes straight out of movie. Niggas pulling your strings, you trusted it. Any question, the drama, you done with it. I'm needing that, needing that closure. Still a old dog, but I don't roll over. No, I don't. Long move, I don't do sober. Living without you, to turn me to loner. Niggas did us straight cobra. Never loved once till you, now it's over. I don't regret we did it. Act up now, but who am I kidding? I keep that part of me hidden. After no rock, I stay in the mission. Don't you come back just for me You diss me, diss me This ain't coming cheap to me A lost cause, just be Cause I let you back and girl That don't mean safety Better get to packing cause I be with the hardest where the darkness be I can't think of shit
shit to get you off of me. And I just like the way how the chorus is like freaking up. If and if you're not listening, the chorus all together, like each like syllables and such, the way how he's like keeping it in a rhyming and such. Not saying like rhymes, well, half of it is like a rhyme screen. Rhyme screen. Rhyme scheme. And it's hard for me to say what it's good. So not only like he has like some. They, but, blah, 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 I can't even talk. You see why most of the times I don't edit most of the time. I don't even edit, period, because let's face it. I get to show y'all the real me. I want if y'all want to subscribe to me, if y'all always want to see me entertaining as much, always feeling like I'm boring, you gonna see the whole time. But what I was trying to say is with Black Diamonds, not only he can be saucy on a song, but don't get this nigga, don't sleep on this man's able to really rap. Like really put up a scheme like that rhyming and such that I keep that part of me hidden. After no rock, I stay in the mission. Keep run free. Don't you come back just for me. You diss me, miss me. This ain't coming cheap to me. I lost cause just me. Cause I let you back and girl, that don't mean safety. Better get to packing cause I be with the hardest where the darkness be. I can't think of first part is like the four part syllable and then he does the three part syllables and such the one two three four da 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 one two three four like I broke bro like that's what makes it that's why I say where if you have a chorus that's like a hook like it gonna hook you into it that freaking fire just the just like the first part of the chorus the four part syllable and such like the end of each one, and then the last part is the three syllable row. That's fine. Be at your crib, keep run free. Don't you come back just for me. You diss me, miss me. This ain't coming cheap to me. A lost cause, just me. Cause I let you back and go. That don't mean safety. Better get to packing cause. I be with the hardest where the darkness be. I can't think of shit to get you off of me. I'm supposed to share you when you offer me You offer me, yeah, you offer me Shout out to Otaku Underworld, man You know they always do it, right? Yeah, so like I said, this is already playlist And now to You know what I am Some call it sexy Don't be mad Be something deadly even if I'm an exotic dancer, hold this on, I'm gonna keep my pants up. Doesn't mean that. Cuts out. And it basically like this with the why I put this in here, cause I, cause I saw on Twitter that Fable saying that he's working on a new vocals for his second channel. Cause let's face it, and I hope Divide is too. Fable and Divide, I hope y'all is coming back to them. I hope y'all is working new songs for y'all second channel, cause. All I'm saying was with Fable, ever since with that Endless Nightmare one, and the fight with the freaking Wolf, Little Bro, Lantern Hollow, the vibe of the ego of the vibe, Lantern Hollow, I want, all I'm saying is, ever since Whistle, Bro, I want more of that. I want more songs that are, I'm not saying it should be there all the time, but give me some more. Give me some new stuff that's our, that's like that. That's all I'm saying. But like I say, here to end it off now, JT. Music. You know what I get? Some call it sexy. Don't mean that I care. Be something deadly. Even if I'm an exotic dancer, hold this on, I'm gonna keep my pants up. Doesn't mean that I'm not sexy. Even when I feel empty. Don't know it. I'm feeling fresh. You feel the vibe. You're looking less. So look alive. My feather feet are feeling fly. These streets ain't clean, but I keep my stride. You wanna take? Come take a bite. Don't fake it. Make it smile. Why go with the flow? Just ride the tide. Ladies, good luck staying dry. Now let it rock. Don't let it slide. Doesn't matter whether you're black or white. Too thick and thin. I've kept my pride. That confidence is a mess. I lie. And my disguise is my swag. Kind of feels like I'm in drag. But I got nothing left to hide. So I let it out. I'm dead inside. <sighs> I'm trying to stay positive. But honestly, with the walking dead out there, it's like, what's the point? And you know what? I'm going to say.
saying, dude, this city sucks. It's so hard to get around. The infrastructure was bad enough before the apocalypse. But I'm gonna stay positive. Because I wanna live it large, like every day. LA's a place to do it. Or so they say. Ready, set, then ignite. You wanna smoke? Come get a light. This Imagine that you are doing that. Like, when the apocalypse comes and there's freaking zombies, you wanna stay. The, you're in a freaking zombie apocalypse and you want to talk about staying forget trying to stay positive nigga try staying alive <laughs> now that you want to smoke come get a light this party's on i'm dead invited even if i leave your head divided my stream is up go spread the hype need a quick vibe check don't let it die you know my style is fresh and fly no more slumming get fly. what's that like some freaking Michael Jackson like type vibe what the heck JT music that's what the thing is in such when it comes to nerdcore like the pillars you can say are like JT music Dan Bowl Supenium like they all and there's possibly more too I can say rock okay well I haven't known much of Rocky honestly I'm being real with y'all I could say Rocky but that's for maybe Maybe, but I'm just saying from like Dan Bull, the Stupanium, and JT, them three niggas is like do something different and such when it comes to the nerd for like especially on video games and such. Like, not a lot of nerd for artists you see is like getting real, you can say getting real jiggy with it. <laughs> I'm just saying, it ain't quite dawn, but the dead are rising, mental health, plans to fight problems all I did. Inside. Full disclosure, before the outbreak, I was going to therapy. Then my therapist tried to eat me. So please just give me a little fucking space because it's been really awful trying to navigate that while dealing with the worldwide apocalypse. But I'm gonna say positive! We don't need your yeah. just say not a lot of nerdcore artists well let me say it like this i would say the exception 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 of jt music because with his like i mean from the song that i reacted to him from two weeks ago with him and stupendium with his song the mighty doom rap that sucker is almost at half a mi half a million almost at like is that like 300 plus k views right now and that's just in two weeks so by the third or fourth by the third or fourth week or so i could say that shit is gonna be at half a million just saying but for the other artists and such in nerdcore like jt not jt's freaking black diamonds like rap night tutsu sword soon and such and many more don't get it wrong there are many more I feel like most of the times when it comes to music mayhem, that this would be for them. Because I can put like the other big nerdcore artists and such, but hey, sometimes, like I said, there are certain other nerdcore artists out there that needs to get like that recognition and such. So even though if my fan base is a little bit slow, well, not, let me, let me not say not slow, sorry, not slow. Like, not as big and such, I might say, right? With many people who keeps on trying to come in here and subscribe, I want to make sure they get my taste and such in how I feel about certain music, especially nerdcore and such. So, hey, 
I always try to do my best to give out, to react to all the nerdcore music out there because with this series and such, I feel like I am doing that. But either way, hope y'all enjoyed this music mayhem and also want to say this before we end this off. Today, April 23rd, right? Today is my father's birthday. So in the comments below, not only tell me what you thought, thought about this reactions down in the comments below, but also if you could just wish my dad a happy birthday in the comments below because he's 60 years old now. So if you could wish him a happy birthday in the comments down below. But either way, it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let's go.